let's for this let's take one example i am drawing one circuit So what is the definition of node? Node is a junction where two or more than two branches meet. Look at here. Here is a junction. Here 3 ohm resistance, 4 ohm resistance, 5 ohm resistance meet at this point. Let's say called is at A. This is point A. Here these three branches meet. This one, this one, this one. Here is a node. Take the minimally connected. If there is no negatively connected plate or one branch as a zero hold, that is take one node as a ground. We are learning to understand how to use this. Kirchhoff's current law in nodal analysis give signs how current will flow generally just current will flow from positive plate to negative plate that is the conventional current direction let's say this is I2 this is I1 so I1 will flow from this 9 volt battery and it is incoming for node A I2 is incoming for node A and let's say I3 will be the if the current flowing through 4 ampere 4 ohm sorry 4 ohm resistance nodal analysis is based on the law that is KCL Kirchhoff's current law that it says that incoming current at node is equal to outgoing current look at in the circuit there is i1 it is the incoming current for node a i2 incoming current for node a and i3 in outgoing current for node a for nodal analysis three points are important first of all draw the circuit and then give direction of currents it is based on your choice you can give any direction that's not the very much important generally current flows from positive plate to negative plate so i give this direction as i1 here positive plate i give this direction as i2 we have to find these currents what will be the value of current and using nodal analysis using kirchhoff's law and this is ohm's law so at node A, at node A, what are incoming currents? I1 plus I2 is equal to incoming current is equal to outgoing current I3. This I1 can be written as look at I is equal to V by R. The potential difference, the potential difference that is V and divided by resistance. So I1 is written as 9 current flow from higher potential to lower potential. 9 minus A upon R3 ohm plus I2. Higher potential 10 volt minus I that is at lower potential. We are considering it because we have given direction and the, the main law behind it is that current flow from higher potential to lower potential by 5 is equal to I3. Here higher potential is A minus 
we have considered one simple node or most probably you can take this zero volt node as a ground and it should be connected to the negative plate from both the sides it will be easy for further calculations so uh, this is a good choice minus zero pi four so i have just converted this equation and elaborated it in this form and it is based on i is equal to v by r and this is based on kirchhoff's current law so we can now easily find we can what is the value of a Four multiplying four to each term so minus twenty a minus twelve a is minus thirty two a. 180 plus 120 is 300 is equal to 15a. I take this 32a there. So a is equal to 300. Upon five plus two seven three plus one four. Using calculator, we can find. After calculating this, a is equal to six point three eight volt. Now put this value of a, that is six point three eight volt, in this equation. We will no. To calculate individual I one, for individual I one, take this term and put the value of A. Then we will find what is the value of I one. Then I two. Similarly, then I three. Let's see. Now we have find the value of A that is six point three eight. We will put this value to find out what is the value of I one. So we take this only for I one is equal to nine minus this a six point three eight divided by three is equal to I two this I two is equal to ten minus six point three eight upon five. Is equal to and this I three six point three eight by four is equal to by using calculator you can calculate the values and we will get the answers of for I one I two I three by calculating we get the values of I one I two I three as I one is equal to zero point eight seven three ampere. I two is equal to zero point seven two four ampere and I three is equal to one point five eight ampere. 